Yo. Sex, eh? You know, it's hard when you're not motivated. When your head is not disciplined to work out every day like you promised and you skip one day. And what do you eat for the first time in one week? Because you felt hungry at 11 p.m. What do you eat? Loteria. You eat that. And that. And that. And that. Your diet has failed. What happened? What happened? What happened to the, to the determination? What happened to your body? Huh? Well, you lost some weight, bro. What happened? What happened to all the shit that you bought? All the tacos and all the chicken breast shit? What happened? Huh? You're not eating it. You let yourself down. And you feel bad. And usually, at this moment, I would just go again this whole day and eat a lot of bullshit. But no, I'm not. Because I want you guys to be a part of this journey. And watch me not eat bullshit for one day. Transformation, one, two, three. Let's get to work. Let's go, go. I found a man. No book. I'll be right. Don't get the song. It's nerve. I know. Get on. Get on. Get on. Now, no. Right. Copyright. Boy, copyright, huh? Don't get this song copyright. I love this song. Man, man, man. The part where in the driving no one speaks. Guys, we have a new office. And I'm gonna give you a short office tour right now. We got an aircon that can also act as a heater. You know what I'm saying, right? By Wiesen. Yeah. It's a smart inverter. Yes. LG, life is good. Not always. Yeah, look at that pretty ass. Look at that. Ooh, look at that pretty ass. Ooh, look at that. We got that. That's a, a meeting table. That's a white wall. And we got some uh, ingredients there. Look at that. Ooh, sexy. This kitchen. Ooh. We got a kitchen. Ah! Ooh. Ah! Ah! Are you curious what that is? That's a refrigerator. Woo! Woo! Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. Door dito. Ayan, it's a pang door. Woo! We got uh, another refrigerator. This is the, um, the cold fridge. Some of you not might not know what I'm doing. Um, I, you think I'm funny, ha? Huh? But I have a job, ha? Huh? And my job is to my job <laughs> my job I am a sales and marketing guy huh? in this company po. and basically what I do is um, I go out there and look for people to open the craft works a brand a franchise which sells uh, beer and American pub it's good my first meeting today, we're going to Sung Myung University, Girls University, area. Uh, we have a perspective guy who wants to open something there. So I'm going to check the area out and uh, see if, uh, you know, there's some shops or stores that is good, that seems to be good to open a, a, a craft works, a pub, American style pub, okay? So I'll see you in Sung Myung University. Check this out, this is so cool, bro. This is like high tech. Hi, Ted! Part of my job is um, I meet a lot with real estate agents and look for good spots. And now I'm in Sukte, over there. That's what a real estate uh, place looks like in Korea. And they give you the prices of the stores. So I got a price for that. Let's go to a go to, uh, couple of Budongsans, um, real estate agents. Two or three because they have different like uh, properties and uh, lots and shops for sale because that's kind of like their secret shit. Okay, in Korea you pay a mortgage, uh, not a, a deposit. Of, uh, if you want to get a shop to open a restaurant or something, you probably pay like 40 or 50 million won. Or in Gangnam area, depending on the area, you probably pay up to like 100 million. And then you pay a monthly rent, of course, depending on the area and the floor. And then you also, if it's a good area, usually you pay a premium. A premium. Which is another like 300, uh, 100 million or something. It's a good spot. 
So basically what I'm trying to say is you gotta have a lot of money if you wanna open a shop. Because we are living in a capitalist era. So you gotta hustle and make the money if you wanna open a barbecue shop like me in the Philippines. Just gotta do what you gotta do, bros. Going, bro. In one kilometer, take the one. road besides the underpass. Besides the underpass? No. Take the road besides the underpass. The fuck? Huh? Besides the underpass, you Tagalog, you you you, you Taglish na? Huh? In 500 meters, 500. safe driving monitoring zone. Safe driving monitoring zone. Or Besides the underpass now takes the roads besides the underpass. 500 meters. 300. Oh na. Besides the underpass. Safe driving daw. Oh, maligayang Pasko. Besides, I am taking the road besides the underpass. How many times you have to tell me? Yes. 300 meters. Turn left. Ah. Turn left. Oi, turn left, night, like, turn right. Dang, in a night, turn right, nito. Leche. Turn left, turn left. Do the left, to the left. Everybody say, up the hands to the left. I don't know, but it's Beyonce's song, so it will be very, very good. To the left, to the left. 300 yeah. meters, turn right. Turn right. Turn right. To the right, to the right. Turn right, to the right. Oi, oh, dang, in a. Oi, let me pass. Uh, besides the underpass, ah. Uh. That's what I. That's what I do before I eat. I kind of like work my mouth, so it like kind of knows that it's gonna eat. That was one of the longest meetings I had. Boy, I'm Dalvin Chonan. Um, it's kind of crazy. Uh, going on from here is gonna take an hour and a half. So uh, here we go, guys. Uh, long meeting about the places, the shops. I mean, you know, I mean, they're, they're you know, mm, they need around like 400 to 500 million won to start uh, a shop, you know, and, and, and pesos, since you guys are mostly Filipinos, I'll tell you how much that 500 million won in pesos is, okay? That's 20 million pesos. You need like 20 million. Uh, to do it or even more maybe like 20 to 30 million pesos to open a shop in Korea to be specific to open craftworks so yeah my job is to you know look at shops and places see if the shop is going to do well if it's in the main street if it's in the drinking street how much uh, profit they're gonna make and with that profit how much money they're gonna make it's in the end it's the bottom line they they sometimes say they don't care about money but everybody cares about money that's how the world works right now in 2018 okay guys uh, I'm home for five million years I'm home oh, I just lie in the bed like this uh, and I just kind of relax and uh, on my phone usually at this time this is the hardest time my brain and my mind just kind of like wants to just give up because I had such a long day, bros. Like I woke up, I broke in the air, huh? And then I had to like go to work. I had the first meeting in the women's university. Ooh, there were some chicks there, huh? And then um, I had to, these real estate agents telling me all this information. I had to call a lot of people, and then I had to drive one and a half hours, almost two hours to Chonan. I had a meeting with this guy. And now, so 
usually I just watch YouTube and just fuck around and then get lazy. But today, today is different. Even if I failed yesterday, today I'm not failing, bros. I'm not failing. I'm not failing. Uh, I have a 9 o'clock appointment with my PT in Yoon's gym. I'll show you guys later. Guapo, ya no? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. You gotta be proud. You gotta be proud of your medal. I'm at the gym. I'm be proud of my medal. Man, 21 kilometers. I'm gonna work out with this shit like that, like that. I'm gonna work out. Check this out. Sakit na yung leg ko. A leg bend. Leg is leg, diba? Leg. No? Yung tenga. Tenga to. Ano to? Yung ilong, ilong ko. Sakit. Nag, ano? Nag backfire. Nito ganito. Bang. Bagsak sa ilong. Hindi ba nasa kong chan-chan niya siko? Hindi. Wali ka ke. Tak chaba su siko. Kanchan yung dera su siko. Or. Sungut coach niyem. Wow. Shat. Ya mong cha. いい感じ back from the workout guys so the lesson the moral today for me was don't let one failure determine who you are okay if you failed yesterday so be it you did shit you ate shit but today's a new day tomorrow's a new day i mean today was a new day does it make sense to you but anyways you get that right a lot of fun today uh i'm gonna go start editing this 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 thingy manziggy and uh hopes to see you guys tomorrow i don't know how long i'll last it's just kind of a challenge to do this um daily maybe <laughs> i'm just aiming for like three days or four days or whatever so here you go guys see you tomorrow jebal go 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 peace i know you like the sumo huh? well, like instagram yan, huh? Well, like, yan, huh? peace <laughs>